Hey horse lovers, welcome back to Free Spirit Equestrian. So today we are gonna be revealing our newborn foal's name and gender. I am so excited and I'm still so over the moon about the entire experience. So we put a party together and let me tell you, it took so much work. I've literally been up since 6 a.m. and the party starts at 6. It has been so much time and effort to put this together. I will show you some bits and pieces, plus you'll get to see the name and gender reveal. It's going to be such a fantastic day. Okay, let me show you around the party. So here we have like a little place where you can take pictures. And then I have all of the tables set up with decorations, bubbles, candy. I just had so much fun with this. I think it looks super cute and you can see it's all pink and blue to go along with our gender and name reveal theme here. We set up a bunch of tables and chairs and different hangout spots just right in the yard here in front of the barn and I added some flowers and bubbles and then we have lays here where you can pick team boy or team girl and then wear the lay so I thought that was super fun and then we're going to have our desserts and cookies and trail mix right here and then we'll also put our cake down here later and that's how we'll reveal the name is with the cake the name is on it and then this was my favorite part so look at these little halters that you got me horse lovers we have a colt and a filly so basically they have to pick a name only one gender and then put it in that bucket then we have some drinks we're gonna have lemonade so yeah i just had a blast setting everything up and i hope you think it looks super pretty too So because I'm doing a live feed once guests arrive, I won't be able to film the actual party, but I will get some bits and pieces and you'll get to see the most important parts, which is of course the foal's name and gender reveal. I am so excited. I thought so much about this party and I put in so much time and effort because to be completely honest with you, this was such a special experience for me. I know for some people they might just think, oh, well, it's just a mare that you got from an auction that was pregnant and had a foal, big deal, right? Well, to me, it was super special because it was my first full. And to be completely honest with you, I'm most likely not gonna have like kids. So this is basically like my kid, like I'm so excited. Like obviously I know it's Belle's full, but you get what I'm saying. So I make this super fun because literally my animals are my babies and I just want it to be super special and a really fun experience and just show you too. The guests will be arriving soon, but let's go say hi to Belle and Fulls. How are you? You're so cute. Hi. How are you? Hi. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> butt itchies little booty itches the little booty itches oh I got you I got the booty itches I got them Another fun thing we did is we have these lays and essentially whatever gender you think the foal is, you go and grab that color. So obviously I already know, so I have both colors, but isn't that fun? Okay, people are starting to arrive. It's a gorgeous night to have a party here at Free Spirit Farm and everybody looks so great. I'm so excited that they came to celebrate with us. And then you see Miss Penelope here. She's hanging out and then we have Koa as well. I just love Penelope. She's my little mini pig. She lives in the house but comes outside every day. And she's just so adorable. And then you can see Koa is wearing a lei as well. He apparently is going team girl. But yeah, it's just an absolute blast. We're eating, drinking, hanging out, just enjoying ourselves. And the girls are having fun. I have some students here, family and friends. Okay, horse lovers, it is the moment we have all been waiting for. We are about to reveal the newborn foal's gender. Are you so excited? I cannot wait to show you what the gender is. On the count of three. Oh, 
<laughs> well, horse lovers, we can welcome our brand new filly. Did you guess right? We are so excited. Wow. <laughs> What's the name? Now we're going to read some of the name guesses. So all of the boy ones are out because, of course, it is a filly. So let's read some of them off. Okay, we got Cinder. So I'm guessing like Cinderella. Uh, Rapunzel. We have Daisy. No, that one. That one's really boring. No, I'm just kidding. I love that name. Okay, we have Ariel. Or Ariel. Here's Sebastian. That wouldn't be a bad one. Rose. Which Beauty one's Rose? Oh. Okay, we have Chip. Who oh, put Chip at? <laughs> Katie, where's she at? No, it was. Are you kidding me? Kenny? Okay, so this is pink, and then this is. No, I'm just kidding. I thought she was a girl. Do you already okay. have a name? Tiana? Picked out? That's cute. We I do have a name picked one. out. What? We have a name picked out. Oh, Ariel? Yeah. I was going to say Jasmine. Jasmine? Ariel? Wow. You guys know I love redheads, right, Kennedy? <laughs> Nala? I like this one. Nala would My be cute. My mom's watching. My mom likes that one, but she knows. She knows. <laughs> Beauty? And Aurora. Okay, so no one guessed the name because I'm that creative. No, I'm just kidding. So what we're going to do now is we're going to bring out the cake and the cake has the name on it. Okay, so official name reveal for our little filly here. So let's do that. Okay, so we can officially welcome our brand new member of Free Spirit Equestrian, our little filly, Esmeralda. Oh. Because she's a free spirit, because it's free spirit equestrian, she's bold, she's independent, but she's so cunning and willing and smart at the same time. So we're very excited to see her journey here at the farm. It's our first full born here. And yeah, so please welcome Esmeralda. Esmeralda. <laughs> No, this is my knife I've had since but it works. college. You have a pink knife too? She's like, Shay thought of every detail here. <laughs> yep. All right, who wants cake? Me. <laughs> Me. 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 Yay! Me. So cute. Is it a romper or a dress? Oh my gosh, I love rompers. She's at camp. Oh. Are you excited? Yeah. So do you like the name? I love the name. Good. I'm very happy it's a girl too. Yeah. So horse lovers, I really hope that you love the name Esmeralda. I just think it suits her so well because she's so independent and bold and she's like a free spirit. Like plus this is free spirit farm and it just really, really struck me. So actually originally, if it was a boy, I don't want to share the name because if I ever get another uh, male horse, I really want to use this name. So it's super special to me. Okay. To be honest, I was thinking of naming the full Cinderella after Prince Charming. However, I just, when I saw this filly, I just, Asmerelda just really, really hit me. And honestly, I may end up keeping her forever. I don't know what the case is going to be. Like I said, of course, I'm going to keep her until she's at least started under saddle and go from there. But of course, like I can never say for sure, because my goal is goodbye when it comes to these horses is to find them, work with them, give them a wonderful life, and then find a perfect suitable home after I put a ton of time, effort, care, and training into them. So we'll just have to see. I don't know. Okay. I don't know. But anyways, I really just love that name and I've been saving it for a special horse. So regardless, if she stays with me forever or if she eventually moves on that's just such a special name and I wanted to give it to her so I hope you like it too 
also when it comes to the filly, it's going to be so interesting to get her DNA test. So I still need to get samples of the hair, but like I said, it'll just be so fascinating to see if the foal is a buckskin or a dun or a gray. Obviously, Belle is gray, but we don't know who the sire is. So we'll just see. But right now, she's technically a dun slash buckskin. There's just been a big debacle about it. But either way, that's her current coat color. So it'll be fascinating to see what she actually is. But yes, it could most likely be gray. And we'll see if her eyes will stay blue. Like I said, they keep getting lighter, but who knows? This is the fun part. It's always a mystery. <laughs> Okay, horse lovers, make sure you like, comment, share, subscribe to the channel, turn on your notifications so you don't miss anything Free Spirit Equestrian, anything with Belle and her foal, or any other adventures we go on. And I'll see you next time, horse lovers. Bye!